Greetings all you main acts of Minds Runner Crimes, and yep, yet another SCP video. This is an SCP that I kind of forgot about, but I was all, oh, O's85. That's a good one. I'll do a video on it. So, SCP-085 is a direct result of an experimentation between SCP-067, which is a pen, and SCP-914, which is probably one of my favorite SCPs. Uh, the big clockwork machine that I did a video on that you put different things into it. So it was drawn on a sheet of paper using SCP-067 and then put into 914 on the fine setting. And then we have a sentient 2D being that likes to be called Cassie. So Cassie is sentient, highly intelligent, of course, just like a normal human, just as intelligent as a human, and very well knows that she is in a th uh, 2D space in a 3D plane. She can't communicate through voice. She can only communicate through writing and sign language. However, if she transfers herself to a comic, she can uh, communicate through speech bubbles like a comic would. This is really cool, but also it is kind of sad for Cassie herself because she can't escape. She can't get into the third uh, into the third dimension. She can only exist in two dimension. And every single object that she transfers over to, every single like piece of paper, like every drawing or whatever, turns into her black and white form. So a comic would turn black and white. Uh, a painting of a grove would turn black and white. But this is really cool. I like how it's an SCP made from other SCPs. I wonder how many others are made from other SCPs. That'd be really damn cool. And again, it was made using 914. I fucking love 914. I mean, who doesn't like a freaking... A clock machine that turns things into other things and makes weird things. It's awesome. So, that's really basically it about this SCP. There really isn't a whole lot to it. It doesn't have like a thousand addendums or documents attached to it like some SCPs do. It is a safe class SCP, of course. Um... But I will, of course, leave the uh, page in the description for this SCP. Next SCP I want to do is a Keter class SCP. I want to talk about something dangerous, like severely, severely dangerous. I know there's one called The Flesh That Hates. I might have done a video on that. I might have not. Um, there's also SCP, was it 339? I think I did a uh, video on that. I would have to. I would actually have to check. Yeah, it is SCP-339. Uh, the be silent, be still. I already did a video on that way back. Um, so let me know some Keter class SCPs that you want me to talk about. Um, not SCPs that I've already done. I, I think I've done the classics like 682 and 106. I might have done 106. If I haven't, I'll go ahead and talk about uh, the rotting dude. Um, as Marker Flark calls him, Radical Larry. Uh, so, you know. Anyway, that was SCP-085. Really not a lot to this one, but it's short and sweet. And also, I feel bad for this SCP. I know they're all fake, but could you imagine that? Like... What even the hell? It's so weird. But anyway, that does it for this uh, SCP. Next one is up to you guys. What Keter class SCP do you want me to talk about? Or maybe it's just a very dangerous Euclid SCP. I want to stay away from the safe SCPs for now because the safe SCPs are too safe. Um, I like danger. I like talking about things that could end the world. Like XK... Uh, and the world scenarios, that's what they call them, XK. Holy crap, that sounds serious. So, thank you guys so much for watching. 
And remember, in Troby, we trust.